DPP Chairwoman Tsai Ing-wen was busy campaigning today for her party's legislative candidates in Yunlin and Jiayi. While many expect the DPP to take all 10 legislative seats in these southern counties, Tsai is urging caution, telling constituents not to be overly confident. Meanwhile, KMT presidential candidate Hong Xiu-ju was also on the campaign trail in Xinzhu, where she urged the public to disregard campaign rumors. Tsai Ing-wen's supporters began cheering when she emerged from her vehicle. One individual even presented her with a special cypress comb with her likeness drawn on it. <laughs> this was the location where the movie Kano was filmed. Tsai took the opportunity to admire the Japanese architecture as well as campaign for her party's legislative candidates in the area. According to recent election assessments, the DPP is expected to win a majority of the legislature, taking a minimum of 64 seats. Until votes are cast, you can't rule out any variables or potential changes or outcomes, as we should all exercise caution. As for the KMT presidential candidate, Hong Shouchu visited Xinju's Yiming Temple today. She has been battling persistent rumors that the party could be seeking another presidential candidate, though this has done little to shake her confidence. I have been officially nominated by the entire KMT National Congress, so everyone can rest assured. You shouldn't spend your day listening to rumors and simply save your breath discussing such things. Hung also strongly refuted rumors that she wasn't able to raise any money from supporters in traditionally deep blue regions. Yeah. While Hong was busy denying rumors and defending herself, Tsai was busy downplaying expectations by warning supporters of the dangers of becoming overly optimistic as the election nears.